The outbreak of a new COVID-19 variant has led many nations around the world to put in place various measures in controlling its spread, with South Africa and the United Kingdom being one of the most affected regions. Since we will have a limited capacity of the vaccine, our health workers will be given first priority. No citizen will be forced to receive the vaccine. Kilifi's Kenya Medical Research Institute, Kemri, recently stated that the new COVID-19 variant had arrived in Kenya after two patients were diagnosed with the virus in the area. Health CS Mutahi Kagwe indicated that the national government is now switching gears and taking stringent action against the matter. Kwaenda mbele, ni lazima kama nchi ya Kiafrika na kana na 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 sana sana nchi ya Kenya ni lazima tufikirie sana vile sisi wenyewe tutakuwa na manufacturing sector ambayo inaweza pia kutengeneza hizi vaccines kutengeneza dawa ya malaria kutengeneza dawa ya HIV on the other hand the covid-19 vaccine is expected to arrive in the country later next month sana sana tunatarajia vaccine inaitwa AstraZeneca Despite the optimism of this statement, citizens are being reminded to pay more attention to the regulations issued by the Ministry of Health. Even as we manage the COVID-19 situation, we don't know what the future holds for Kenya. Nobody knows at all, especially now that the variant is here with us. While answering the government's relaxation on mass testing, CS Mutahi Kagwe noted that due to the high prices of the testing kits, the national government is now conducting targeted testing. Ben Kerera K24, Evening Edition.